Yeah, that's for sure. That, that, that leads me into the next point about love and reciprocation. How did y'all feel, or how did you feel actually, both of y'all actually, about about the whole the whole Drake thing? I ask you more what? because Drake. you were born in you were born in Houston, correct? Right. So I, so that's kind of more like I I want to talk to a person who was born in Houston like me. How did you feel about the whole Drake coming here, him repping the city but not being from here? I mean, and then the that's his twins and all him, that. Him like him him repping Houston is his ultimate like gratitude because he he blew up in Houston. That's how I felt. You know what I'm saying? That's how I felt. But a him lot of blowing up in like, Houston. Him blowing up in Houston. I mean. Shit, man! Houston loves him. Everyone loves him. Exactly. But, I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie. Anyone that says it, that hates on him, he ain't really got to do. He ain't really got to do nothing for the city of Houston, bro. He, he really got. Like, he ain't got to do nothing for the city of Houston. Yeah. He from Canada. Yeah, exactly. I know, but and he's and he's already done a lot for it too. He's this is where, this is where he got his opportunity. Yeah, at. I mean, no, I, if you had if you got your opportunity in Cali, you. You know, say this podcast is in Cali, da da da, and bam, you get a TV deal, whatever, da da da. Yeah. You won't start, you know. No. Show your I ultimate mean, gratitude. And the fact that so. he, the fact that he did that, the the, the freestyle on the um, on the what's it called, the November beat or whatever. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I love like it. That just kind of just shows you that he, he he he's really studied Houston rap. You could tell he studied the Houston culture. You right. Know what I'm saying? So that's good, man. I, I like I like Drake. I think I think I, I don't know why. The, so I don't really I didn't really look into why the Sauce Twins had a problem with it or what their issue nah, was. Nah, because he didn't do that. He didn't drop too legit to quit it. That's that's, that's it. Nah, nah, nah. I ain't gonna lie. I heard some else. OG Ron C drop at a Drake tribute that I went and performed at. He called me out to come perform. Shout out OG Ron C. Shout man. out OG Ron C. Yeah, he's man, he's supposed man. to be coming in with Iron for a for and an he, interview. He uh he had dropped a record. You know that uh that Madonna. Okay. Off of if if you was reading this, you know what I'm saying? Okay. It's too late. Man. Walt had a stupid ass verse on that hoe. Oh. <laughs> it just yeah. didn't get dropped. Shout out Sauce Walt. That, ver- that version yeah. just didn't get dropped. I ain't going to lie. I, t- I take my hat off to bro, you know what I'm saying? Because like you said, 0405 is when it was, you know what I'm saying? It yeah. was all about the H, you know what I'm yeah. saying? Walk reopened that door for all these new up and coming artists because he came and he took Bro. something that was already present here yeah. and he made it cool kinda, and young and fresh and fly. You know what I'm saying? Like you know what I'm saying? So I mean, I like just yeah. You can't you can't you can't you can't, you can't dodge that shit. Like yeah, it's it's, like, it's evident he has a he has a, he has a large fan base. You know what I'm saying? People people fuck with him and he from here. Yeah, I feel and like he, he really do the shit he talking about. He knocked so. down. I feel like he knocked down what Kirko knocked down first. I feel like Kirko opened the doors, and then everybody, a lot of other people came and knocked that. I mean, yeah, 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 no, no, yeah, 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 no, no, Kirk, 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 Kirk came home. I remember being sixteen. Yeah. I remember, I remember being sixteen, and you know, what I'm saying, sitting on my bed in Florida and seeing drinking my cup come on for the first time. Oh, I love that and then yeah. fast, and that's then one of my favorite records. Fast of forward, all time. fast forward, 2015 and shit, and me and him in the studio working together. You know, what I'm saying, man. so yeah. it's just I, I remember that shit, but. Like he did, I I give you, I I see what you're saying. He yeah. opened that door, but I'm talking about, bro, from 08, cause yes. that was like 08, 09, yeah, yeah, yeah. right? Like, well, we're no, really no, like, no, no. Oh, was, no, oh, 09, 2010, something like that. You know what I'm saying? But then you think about yeah. it, that's a five year drought to 2015. Yeah. 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 You feel me? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So walk, 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 slip, reopen that door, man. And so you know sure, what I'm saying? Yeah. You got shout out to Sauce Walker, man. Hell yeah. And then, and then, and then so. stood and then stood for what he believed in. Shout and out came out, you know what I'm saying? Sanchi P. I talked to your manager about getting you on the show. <laughs> y'all want to come? Y'all are more than welcome to come, man. Uh, uh, y'all. Hey, man, that guy, that guy has it's heavy up. business that going boy, on boy, over there. That's what I said. Like, hey, well, hey, I, man, hey, hey, I, I, sauce, I, I wish I had it that good, <laughs> man. You know what I'm saying? I told him, I said, I'll talk to your man. I said, I'll talk to your manager, but you want to come on, you're more than welcome to. Yeah. I know the rap Lord. Hallelujah. Pouring another drink, 